Hello, this is Monkey Dry, and this will be my chapter 5 reaction on Mashable Magic and Muscle. So, last time on Mashable Mash ticked off the one guy you really shouldn't cross. Not me for my tummy. This guy is just making some cream puffs for himself. I wish Pops could taste these cream puffs too. Okay, either would you spend your life being hunted like a dog or seize this chance to turn this society on its head? Hmm. I have to become this top student in this academy. <laughs> there's something about the image that, um, there's something about the contrast on the seriousness of what Mash says with how he looks because he looks really as plain and as apathetic as he could be. And right now he is even just munching on a cream pop wearing an apron. And I don't know, just funny to me. Next class is position. So. Hmm. Oh no, my textbook is falling apart. Smirk, smirk. Okay, so everyone's bullying Mash already. Hello again. I waited, I waited for you yesterday, but you never showed up. Why not? Oh, sorry. I baked cream puffs instead. <laughs> I heard you're aiming to be the divine missionary. You know, I've got some pull this device principle. If you do what I tell you, I can put in a good word for you. What do you say? Whoopee! I'll do it. <laughs> this guy's just like... Whoopee! I'll do it. <laughs> and I said, Whoopee! <laughs> why did it? But why do this for me? You seem like fun, and I just love helping people. But it'd be sus suspicious if I did it for free, right? Good point. For starters, carry these for us. Oh, okay. Uh, wipe my shoes for me. Okay. I'm thirsty. Okay. Massage me. Entertain me. Okay. Okay, so he's just using. Mash right now. He's she's just he's just making mash uh, like a slave. Next, let's see. Hmm, another textbook ruined. Finn, could you share your textbook with me? Sorry, ask someone. Thanks. Huh? Oh my. I said no. You're a real pal. Thanks for the broom yesterday. These cream puffs are for you. Uh, sure, but boy, am I relieved. To have a great guy like you for a friend. Aw, Mash is so pure and so trusting. But he doesn't even know that he's being um, done in like this. You've been so good to me. I'm totally in your depth, really. Don't even mention it. You've been a big help. Look at that. I spilled some. Clean it up, will you? Hmm, what's wrong? You will do it, won't you? Okay, so yeah. Side positions is next. Okay, I hate that picture. This is this is really hard because I'm I'm sure that Mash is aware that he's just being used by them, and but he's doing this nevertheless for his and his dad's sake for their peaceful lives. Whoa, it's so clean that it's sparkling. Oh, let's go, Mash, huh? I can't believe that he does whatever we say. You think he'll ever catch on? Next, I want you to burn his robes. Got that, Finn? And <laughs> Do that, I bet he'll take on so. Ah oh, shit, they're really, they're really pushing this too much. I can't. What was that? I didn't hear you. Say it again. I said, I can't do this anymore. Hmm. Oh shit, are those string magic? Oh, okay, he has some string magic. Damn, you've made quite the error. Now drop down and beg for forgiveness. Where did Finn go? I accidentally took his textbook with me. What's that sound? Oh no, Mash saw it. Okay, Mash. Oh, hi there, Mash. What are you doing? Getting an apology. Finn got a bit ahead of, his, of himself. Are you okay, you Finn? Yeah, but you're bleeding. That doesn't matter right now. Mash, it was me. The one who ruined your textbooks. It was me. Shit, it's kind of sad. I was too scared to disobey you called me your friend, but I did horrible things to you. I just... I needed, I needed to apologize to you. I'm sorry. So very sorry. Well, at least, at least you you repented, and you you stood up for Mash, and that's and I really accept the sentiment. Although yes, you did do something bad, but I am positive that Mash will accept your apology. Oh, if only you'd apologize like that to me. Oh, by the way. I'm about to dine with the vice principal. Care to join us? You can leave that dirty little lack here where he belongs. I've been dying to introduce you. You might never get a chance like this again. 
especially if you keep company with a sorry disappointment like him. Oh shit, this guy is scum. This guy is a bastard. Oh, 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 he grabbed his hair and fuck. Oh, he just smashed, smashed, just smashed this guy's face in. You're the one who should be sorry. W what? Double what? That'll get you expelled. Expelled? Big deal. Mash? Actually, <laughs> that serious. That seriously would be a big deal. Fuck! This guy doesn't think of his actions, and I love him for it. W mash. W mash. Okay, so that's all for my chapter five reaction. Oh shit! That was a really short reaction, but nevertheless. Um. So I guess I can do some, uh, some minor character stuff. So I really like. Um, it, it's it's basic stuff, but the way the way it's portrayed, um, it really just invokes some emotions in me. Well, I'm I really understanding and empathetic guy, uh, most of the time. So, yeah. So, seeing, uh, seeing Mash being so understanding about other people's. Wait, what what was he called again? Finn. Yeah, Finn. Finn, Finn, feeling guilty when Mash called him his friend, and then him having to, uh, having to stand up for himself when he thought that things should be enough for this because you know, um, as mentioned in the chapter, he was being ordered to burn Mash's um cloak, which would take things too far because that's your uniform already. I mean. Destroying your text because it's already sabotaging, but like that's minor compared to destroying your uniform. But then, um, him apologizing despite him facing someone that could, you know, um, uh, him standing up with someone that could have easily expelled him for disobeying him because that's what he said. I some uh, it just strengthens that moment for Finn and Mash doing uh, I don't know it was so high seeing Mash just grab that dude on uh, that bastard on his that dude's hair and then smashing his face onto the ground it of course is going to get him expelled but like he he know he didn't really realize it until the moment that it catched up to him and it's it's a very human thing to do having the impulse to do that and it's a very adolescent type and i think mash is a, te a teenager in this part so i do understand why he is so impulsive and why he is why he is so quick to act with his emotions or but I think that's not necessarily just because he is just an adolescent and I do think that's just Mash having his own set of values and his own principles of justice and that's why despite um, having to deal with expulsion later on, I do think that he's going to be nervous because Mash is, um, Mash is quite a expressive guy but not facially. He He's quite talkative but he doesn't really show it that much through his face so that's all and i i'm really loving this series so that's all for chapter five of mashable